Hey guys, Nick here with 22 things. 22 things? Three things that looks like 22 things. Because why not? And today we're like covering things that make life great. And I'm going to get straight into it. Because why not? Well, firstly, water soluble tree fibers. And if that doesn't make sense to you, I'm talking about stuff like coffee, tea, fruits that you can infuse in water, but mostly coffee, because, well, that's the only thing that, like, makes the world turn. Like, if you dig a couple metres into the ground, it's just river of coffee and and ground gods turning the earth. But they look happy because they're surrounded by coffee. That makes no sense. Anybody who's even briefly done science... I don't even know what this is, but it's been here for like a week and I don't like it. But if you've done science, you know that the world does not actually turn by the means of coffee and gods, but it damn well makes us people on the surface live a better life. Second thing, capturing small creatures and just talking to them so that people think that you're not talking to yourself. Because all sane pet owners talk to their pets who never give a response anyway. Like, I've got a dog. I've had cats. I've currently got a small, scaly-skinned dog with a shell. That I call Turts. He's just hanging out. Completely oblivious that I'm talking about him to a camera, which hopefully you guys are watching. Now, third thing, because I don't know how to count to 22, because I'm not good at counting, or aiming my camera at myself. Um, the, the fact that I can find exactly how poor I am using the weird things that have made me poor. I can go just about anywhere and find out how poor I am. Purely by getting on the internet, on my phone, my computer, my tablet. I'm sure if I really tried hard enough, I could probably do it on my Game Boy. Um, nearly sure I could do it on like DS or something like that. I can do it on my Xbox if I want. Just all these things that have made me poor that I can then, in fact, see how poor I am. And I'm, I'm sure if I had a fancy enough car, I could probably check how poor I was in it as well. But I want to thank Obama for that one. My, my, main, my main man, Obama, for all the technology he's made that makes us poor and yet able to. I've been, like, looking up this way a little bit because that's where my screen is relative to my camera. I should really be looking at the camera rather than like looking at the screen. But those are the three things that I want to thank God for. Thank God. For. The three things that I'm thankful in life. Things that make life great. Now I don't know how to get to my own Facebook page. To let you guys know some of the things that you told me in regards to the last video. Like, um, I really should have set this up before I started. No, can't find it. But I think it was, like, there was a thing to do with people not using blinkers. Um, and people who chew really loudly. Now, I don't mind loud chewers but if they're like competitively loud and I start to notice it then it will bug me for like the rest of the meal and people who don't use blinkers like most of the time I'm wary of the road anyway so it doesn't make that much of a difference 
But I see a lot of people who could get themselves into a lot of trouble by not using blinkers. Well, this, this is me done. I'm not even sure what the next one's going to be. But in the comments below, let me know some of the things that you are grateful in life. Like soluble tree fibers. Or coffee as I fuel my body with. Like at the moment, I've got a low blood coffee percentage. As in I've got too much blood in my coffee stream. So I'm going to go have a cup of coffee. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This has been Nick with Nick Does YouTube and 22 things that make life great. Or for the guys who have kept count, three things. I'll catch you guys later. Enjoy.